Alfred Adler, the 7th of February 1870 to the 28th of May 1937, was an Austrian medical doctor, psychotherapist, and founder of the School of Individual Psychology. His emphasis on the importance of feelings of inferiority, the inferiority complex, is recognized as an isolating element which plays a key role in personality development. Alfred Adler considered a human being as an individual whole, therefore he called his psychology, individual psychology, Orgler 1976. Adler was the first to emphasize the importance of the social element in the readjustment process of the individual and who carried psychiatry into the community. A review of General Psychology Survey, published in 2002, ranked Adler as the 67th most eminent psychologist of the 20th century. Alfred Adler was born at Mariahilferstrasse 208 in Rudolfsheim, a village on the western fringes of Vienna, a modern part of rudolfsheim funfoss the 15th district of the city. He was second of the seven children of a Jewish couple, Pauline Beer, and Leopold Adler. Leopold Adler was a Hungarian-born grain merchant. Alfred's younger brother died in the bed next to him when Alfred was only three years old. Alfred was an active popular child and an average student who was also known for his competitive attitude toward his older brother, Sigmund. Early on, he developed rickets, which kept Alfred from walking until he was four years old. At the age of four, he developed pneumonia and heard a doctor say to his father, your boy is lost. At that point, he decided to be a physician. He was very interested in the subjects of psychology, sociology and philosophy. After studying at University of Vienna, he specialized as an eye doctor, and later in neurology and psychiatry.